back to the SST classroom. How are you all? I hope you all fit in fine. Now my dear children, today we are going to do something new. Today we are going to do an activity. So are you ready? Now, first what you have to do, before starting our activity, come on, take out your notebook, pencil, eraser and colors. Everyone are very eager to do an activity, right? So let's start our activity. But before starting our activity, let me tell you what activity today we are going to do. Okay? Now, as you all know, in which country do we live? Can you tell me the answer? We live in India. Yes, my dear children. So, people belonging to a particular country are called citizens. Now, we belong to which country? We belong to India. So, we are citizen of India. We are known as Indian. Those who live in India are Indian. Understood my dear children? Now, every country has some symbol that tells us about identity, values. Values like unity, patriotism, brotherhood. Okay? And culture of the country. Am I right? So, when you see, now just look at this picture. When you see this picture, what you imagine, what represent in your mind? That this is the flag of my country. You feel very proud. Yes, this is the flag of my country. So my dear children, what activity we are going to do? We are going to start the chapter number 4. Lesson number 4. National Symbol. Got it, my 
children? So each color represents something. And in middle you see Ashoka Chakra. And how many spokes are there? There are 24 spokes. How many spokes are there? 24 spokes. And this tells us about the growth and progress of our country. So my dear children, when we sell, when we host our national flag, on which date? Can you tell me? On 15 August and on 26 January. Every year in our school we host our national flag, right? You feel very proud. You come in a neat and clean dress. You purchase a national flag, right? And you stick on your near to your heart, right? Why? You show your love towards our country. Am I right, children? So you should always respect our national flag. If you see national flag, some small children they don't know the values of national flag. So they take, they purchase, they play and they throw on the road. So what is your duty? You should pick up your national flag. You should not throw anywhere on the road. Okay? So it's your duty to respect the to respect of our country. To respect the flag of our country. It should not lie on the floor anywhere. Okay? You will do it. I hope you will do it. Now let's start with your activity. Draw national flag and write five lines about the national flag. You can write the color which indicates everything. You can mention the shape of the flag. You can write the color what it indicates, what it tells us. Okay? So now your time starts now. Thank I hope you have understood the concept of national symbol.